I just got back from Inman Connect in New York City and I'm gonna tell you all about it and we are starting right now. Hey everyone, Karen Carr here in Savannah. This week's video, I am talking to you, my fellow real estate agents. So I just got back from Inman Connect in New York and it was freaking awesome. Not only because I got to eat New York pizza and bagels and see friends that lived in the area, but because I just learned so much. So if you've never been to Inman before, and this was my first time going too, you've heard of Inman Real Estate. They send daily publications of things that are going on in the real estate industry. It is a whole bunch of breakout sessions where they just have phenomenal speakers getting up on stage. And I got to hear people that I totally was fangirl over, overing like Katie Lance from Katie Lance Consulting, uh, Chelsea Pites from Chels Chat. The first day I sat in on an event called Hacker Connect, which is really for software developers that are coming up with solutions for the real estate industry. I will be honest, most of it was going right over my head because I'm not a programmer. But then they had round table sessions where we could choose a table to sit at. And the one I sat at was all about artificial intelligence and how could we possibly use that in the real estate industry. I was the only realtor at the table and they were kind of like, why are you here? <laughs> and after, uh, a while it was kind of cool because they were saying well if we created something like this how could you use it if we did something like this would this be beneficial to you um, they were not talking about coming up with technology that replaces real estate agents and takes us out of the equation they were talking about things that they could come up with to make our lives easier then there was also a trade show where they had all the different booths from the various vendors and the, all of the ones that caught my eye, all of the ones that had something really to bring to the table, we're talking about video, how you can use 360 degree video in your business. There were a lot of companies there that were promoting solutions for promoting your listings. There was also Savvy Homes Portal, which is promoting working it from the buyer side. And they had asked me if I would work in their booth and talk a little bit about how I'm using their platform in my business. There were tons of other providers there but the one, it was like 70% had solutions for video. So if you're not using video in your business yet, you need to get on board. I, I can't even tell you what video has done for my personal business. So you've heard a million times, people do business with people they know, like, and trust. When you are doing video and you are face to camera with them like this, if they watch your video and then they watch another one, then they watch another one, they start to feel like they know you, right? Imagine if you went to the grocery store and you saw, I don't know, insert your favorite actor here. You saw them at the store, you'd be like, oh my gosh, I watch all of your shows, I love you so much. You feel like you know them. They don't know you from Adam, but you feel like you know them. And the same thing happens when you're making videos for your YouTube channel about your real estate business. So I'm all about video. In fact, the very first day of the conference, I got a lead from somebody that said, I found your YouTube channel. I binge watched your videos. I am moving into Savannah in six months. Will you help me? And I said, why yes, yes I can. So that is my wrap up from Inman. If you have at all considered using video in your business, now is the time to make the leap. Start researching it. Start looking into what it is that you need. You don't need a huge investment in uh, equipment. You'd probably be pretty shocked at the stuff that I use to make my videos. Not a lot of stuff. So tell me, are you using video in your business now? Comment down below and let me know, how has it changed things for you? Have you found it to be bringing in leads to your market? I do, I'm getting leads every single week from prospects who wanna buy or sell in my own market. Not only is it giving me a lot of nationwide visibility because if somebody Googles how to sell your house, they might find my video even if they live in Kansas, but I am definitely getting leads from people that intend to buy or sell in my market. And guess what? That was a free lead. I didn't do pay-per-click and I didn't do a Facebook ad. They found me organically through the SEO that is the YouTube search engine. So comment down below, let me know. Do you do it now? Is it working for you? Do you plan to start? I certainly hope that you do. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, do me a favor and hit the thumbs up button, leave a comment, share it with a friend. And if you liked it that much, consider subscribing to my channel. I do post new content every week and I'd certainly love it if you didn't miss anything. Thanks again and we'll see you next week. Okay, we're gonna delete the other video because I had crap on the desk behind me. So that is our wrap up. No, I already said that part. And that's a wrap.